Welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross Plus. This is 480 volts. Uh, you caught me uh, just as I was uh, putting some elements on. I meant to do that before, and I'm doing it now. Surprise! Um, so, our goal is, I guess, to go to uh, Water Dragon Isle and see if we can find the... Uh, the dragon, right? The water dragon? Get the, um... The dragon god's protection? Problem is, if you go there, not only is water dragon isle all dried up, there's a bunch of fairies there, and, uh, yeah, that's where Razzly's originally from. Well, in homeworld, at least. And there's this one fairy there who looks an awful lot like Razzly, named Rosetta. And she tells you that, uh, the water dragon is, uh, has been sleeping for a long time, and there's a thick wall of ice that's blocking us from him, and there's no way we can get to him. So we're basically screwed. We can't get to the water dragon. At least not in this world. But if you go to Opasa Beach, and you switch worlds... Hey, this will be the first time I've brought Kid into this world. Awesome. I'm skipping the cutscene, though. Still doing that. Yeah, as you can see, I was prepping Razzly out for battle. We're going to be needing that. I, I actually went, between now and the last video, I went to uh, Termina, went to the Smithy, and I got all iron and uh, iron armor and helmets for everybody. I would have gotten an iron rod for Razzly, but I ran out of materials. I ran out of eyeballs. Um, this dude here. Oh, it's you, Serge. So you want to go to Water Dragon Isle? Perhaps you should ask the old guy by the pier? He doesn't seem too busy. I'm sure he'll be willing to help you. Why, sure. <coughs> I'm not even gonna bother talking to people. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Wake up. Oh, it's you, Serge. Great day, huh? How's your day been? What was that? You want me to take you to Water Dragon Isle? Well, it's not too far, so I'm willing to take you there for a hundred gold. Sure! Great, shall we get going? Yeah, let's do that. There we go. Uh, I suppose, um... I, I don't need necessarily need Kid for this, but... Thought about having Nikki, but I definitely want Razzly. Alright, now listen here. What, um, for what is about to trans... or to take place... Okay, I, I mentioned before we had, um... There are three steps. Three things you must do or not do to ensure that you get Razzly's final tech. And the very third thing that you need to do is is you need to bring Razzly here to Water Dragon Isle like I am doing here in Homeworld. Now, of course, I already screwed myself out of getting her final tech because, well, I, uh, in this run we've already fought the Hydra with Razzly in the party and we found that it had, an, uh, uh, had some babies. Um, if you do that, you lose your chance to get Razzly's tech. But I do have another file in which I did not do that, so I'll show you Razzly's final tech in New Game Plus. Anyway, it's been a while since he's been here, but the beauty never fades. Now, yeah, if you go to another uh, another world, uh, Water Dragon Isle is completely dried up, and here, you know, it's all nice and watery. Although he's complaining because he doesn't see any fairies around here. But yeah, this is where the fairies land, uh, live. My best. Yeah, I'm not really reading the dialogue, because, uh, you know what, I'm just not really caring to. <laughs> you want to see me read the dialogue? Watch my main run. I did not have Razzly in the party, but, uh, and you can get some treasures here, too. Um, you can get some chests. Every single chest you're going to find here contains iron. Um, there you go. I'm not going to even bother with it, because, well, to be honest... Like I said, I don't really care. This is the last video of this run. After this run, I'm not going to uh, be continuing this anymore. After this video, I'm not going to be continuing this anymore. So yeah, I don't really care about iron and any stuff like that. But yeah, we will we will still have Razzly in the party. If you want to see me go through this area without Razzly in the party, again, watch my main run. Because, well, I took the, the Let's Not Save Kid Path and we didn't have Razzly. So let's just go and find the... Wait, what the... The village! Fairyville is! Wh why did this... Rosetta! Everyone! No! No! It can't! It can't be! Yeah, 
Yep, it's those freaking dwarves. Hmm. Just when I thought it was a rarity to see humans on this remote isle, you hi-ho along. Look at this isle. It's beautiful. A perfect fit for our new home. Too good for these damn fairies. You humans taught us that the world is built on the dead bodies of other species. We taught you that. Now hi-ho away with you, along with the fairies, to the deeps of the sea. Deeps of the sea? Don't you mean the depths of the sea? Yeah. Whoops. We, um... See, when we, when we killed the Hydra and drove the dwarves away from their home, we may or may not have pissed off some of the dwarves. Uh... And you know, honestly, I don't even think I'm gonna fight any of these dwarves. All you gotta do... They killed everyone! Razzly? It's Razzly! You're alright? Uh-huh, I'm alright. Where's Rosetta? The dwarves took her into the cavern! Quick, Razzly! Rosetta needs your help! Oh yeah? And then these fairies here are actually dead. Yeah, I'm not even gonna really bother fighting the dwarves. You don't really need to. Let me talk to this one. Hey, wake up! Please, answer me! Why? Why? Oh, why? Razzly, you are alive, but... but everyone... everyone else is... Yeah, freaking dwarves here. They just brutally murdered all these fairies. And like I said, I'm... Again, if you want to see me fight all the dwarves... Uh, watch my main run. I don't even show it. I mean, I, I... I show, like, one battle, and then the rest of it is just boring. I mean, it's just... it's dwarves. It's all it is. Uh, this one I have to fight. Hmm. <laughs> I knew you'd come. Now we must confront you fools once again. I suppose this is fate. This ends now with your death. Die, human scum. This is fate, huh? Lag. Yeah, so we got a bunch of dwarves here. Yeah, of course, if you don't remember, they're always yellow elemental. High ho course hits everybody. Yeah, it did hurt Razzly a little bit, but uh yeah, she'll be alright. Let's uh let's go ahead and have her kinda teach them who's boss. Well, I was kinda hoping she would uh hit, because she did not get a chance to build up her element power, but uh, you know. Uh I'll go for a Daffy Dwarf. They look like they have more HP. See, like, pretty much anything Razzly uses is going to kill these guys. Just about. And if Serge can score a couple critical hits like he just did, <coughs> he'll also kill them. Kid? Not so much. Oh, I should have used... Well, no, I guess not. I was going to say I should have used a Magma Bomb since that hits everybody. Then I was like, no, because Magma Bombs suck right about now. I think she hit everybody. Good job. Alright, let's use a Bush Basher on that guy. That'll surely end him. Yes. It's the nice thing about having Razzly. Or, you know, choosing this part, this pathway. You got Razzly for this. Yeah, you even if you even if you don't choose the save kid path, you're still gonna. Well, getting the ice dragon. Or getting the water dragon's blessing is optional, but if you choose to do it, you're still gonna have to fight these dwarves, no matter which um, pathway you choose. Basically, um, in the let's not save kid path, what ends up happening is, uh, I mean, again, watch my main run, but all it is is the uh, while we're busy trying to uh, while we're busy in another world. Because if you don't save kid, you don't get to another world. Or you don't figure out how to cross worlds till later. Well, we're busy. Okay, we got a new star level. Uh, meanwhile, here in home world, the humans have been hunting the hydras, and um, by the time we make it back, the humans have already killed off the hydras. So, whichever pathway you choose, the hydra still ends up dying. It's just we're in this one. We're the ones that did it. What strength! I cannot allow our clan to be defeated here. Next, the next will be your last. Come after us humans if you want to save the fairies. Well, that sounded like uh, an open invitation, so I'll do that. Retreat, Talruf, Beardoff. Beardoff, I like that. 
Alright, dwarves, you can run, but you can't hide. Yeah, if you want to fight all the rest of the dwarves, go right ahead. The only two I'm worried about is, uh... Is, uh... Well, the only battles I'm worried about is the dwarf chieftain there. But yeah, in the Let's Not Say it Kid Path, it's just... Humans are just decide to hunt hydras for their materials, right? And I didn't actually want to go out here. Oh yeah, I did want to go out here. And, uh... I'm gonna ignore you guys. And, uh... So either way, uh, the Hydras end up dying, and the Dwarves get driven out of their lands. Here it's a little different, though, because we're the ones who did it. So that's, that's kind of the messed up part. Alright, now. If. This is where it comes down to. If. You, now, we can still have Razzly if you... if The next battle I'm about to fight, if you don't have Razzly in the party, um... Then I, then I think you lose your chance of getting her final tech. If you have not already lost her chance, which I already have, but let's pretend that I haven't. So there's the three dwarves. Note that I have Razzly in my party. Why is he just sort of spinning around? Whatever. And I'm not going to show this battle without Razzly in the party, but anyway. So you made it this far, but you will not find us so easy to defeat. We will settle our scores here by avenging the extinct Hydra in our dying homeland with your death! Oh yeah? Well, let me tell you something, bud. You done pissed off a little fairy I got in my party. She's about to show you what's really going down here. Whoa! Okay, never mind. That's actually slightly intimidating. Okay. Yeah, that is the, uh... I think it's called the Hi-Ho Tank or something. Yeah, Hi-Ho Tank. Um... I will have Sergi get an eagle eye on Razzly. She she's just gonna have eagle eye just so she can uh, you know build up her element power that much quicker. And I'll have Kid uh, get an eagle eye on Sergi. That way, at least for right now, until they screw me over, because I'm sure they will, the element field will be completely green. Which will be nice because these guys are all yellow. Alright, completely green element field. And Razzly's at, uh, you know, you, you attack the main tank. Go. Please don't get interrupted. Oh, she got interrupted. What's he gonna do? Okay, I'm, I'm fine with a physical. I'm so fine with that. Bam. Alright, now let's get, uh, should I do Bush Basher or should I, let's do Razstar. I only get one chance to use it. Let's use it while the field chip effects all green. This is going to do some damage. Ow. Yeah, that did some damage. Now I'll have Kid put on, uh, Strengthen on, uh, Sergi. Kind of hate to get rid of all that green, but whatever. These guys will probably get rid of it themselves. Yeah, they can use, uh, they can use, uh, white elements, so maybe don't have Lucia in the party. There's a couple party members that I've just not recruited. You know, just, just cause. that gonna hurt? Yep, that's gonna hurt a little bit. Um, but not too bad. Oh, you hit the wrong wrong one, kid. Alright, back to, uh, Razzly. What next? Hmm. Okay, you know what? Actually, I'm not even paying attention to my HP. On Sergi's next turn, he really needs to do, like, uh, like, a recover all or something. Let's get this bush basher going. And hopefully, uh, nobody dies on me, because like I say, I want Sergi. How did the buffs wear off? Fine! Don't, don't, don't kill anybody. A high res that strengthens, uh... What? Yeah, just regular defense, that's fine. Let's go ahead and get, uh, recover all going. I wasn't even paying attention to HP, I was just attacking willy-nilly. And you could have Kid Steel if you wanted, but these things don't have anything. It doesn't have anything that I that I need, so I'm not even gonna bother. Yeah, it increased its defense. That does kind of suck. 
but I think it was all physical defense, so if I can have Razzly get a couple more elements off, he should be in good shape. What you gonna do? That's not elemental. Just physical. Does hurt a little bit. Well, didn't hurt Surge. What now? You don't get to do it twice. Come on, guy. I wonder why it didn't hurt Surge. Something I got him wearing, I guess. Alright, Bush Basher again. That's, that did good damage. That thing's still alive. Oh, come on, Surge. Oh, cool. We killed it. So he freaks out, and then a bunch of little dwarves come running out. It's actually quite a funny animation to me. And Kabooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooo
Oh, this music's so cool. It's one of my favorite tracks in the game. That's the water dragon? I don't think so. Thou needeth not explain. I know already what thou seeketh here. Y you do? There is not to be surprised about. It is but a trifle for we sleeping dragons who hath dwelt upon this land for ages. Mount Pyre, the land thou seeketh, is home to the fire dragon. Unless thou quench his red blazes, it will prove a difficult journey. Take this, son of man. My breath can freeze even boiling lava. A dragon with freeze breath. Actually, no, I, I played Spyro 2, and we actually got that in one, one of the later stages. Yeah, so never mind. Yeah, that, no, I'm, I'm totally cool with that. Why do we not get a dragon with lightning breath? You know how like, amazing that would be? I can't even get my dragon to do that. She just... She just, like, breathes fire on whatever the heck she wants, and then just look, gives me that look. Like, you just gonna deal with that. Anyway, Sarah has been bestowed the ice breath. Take my subordinate as well. It shall be useful in holding back the fire dragon of Mount Pyre. And we get the Frog Prince, which is a summon element, which I'm not going to explain. I will explain that in my main run. Watch that. Let me just make it clear, you don't actually have to get the uh, Ice Breath. Um, you'll fight a couple bosses in uh, Mount Pyre if you don't. A couple additional bosses to make up for the star levels you lost. Wilt thou change this world, or wilt thou change thyself? I'm not trying to change the world, I just, you know, kind of want to... I guess I do, I don't know. Wilt thou live on thy mother planet, or wilt thou turn, thou turn thy back on the planet and tread another path? I don't the dragon's got to talk Old English. They said they were chased out of the forest by the humans! and they drifted to our island, so the humans are to blame! Well, that's kind of one way of looking at it, but like, just be grateful that these same humans actually got rid of the dwarves. I mean, I'm sorry about driving them off of Hydra Marshes. I take full responsibility for that, but uh, at least we drove them off of this island. Because of you humans, our village, our friends, have been made victims! I'm sorry. Why can't humans live in harmony with nature? Why do you continue to act the way you do? Don't you see what the outcome of your choices will be in the future? Why? Why? Listen, guys. Maybe I should just let, let the uh, dwarves to have their way with you. Razzle, you're a fairy, so come back to us. You don't have to be with those humans. Sorry. I can't return to the village. I'm still a part of the fairies, but, but, I'm also friends with Sergi and the others too. I can't betray them and go back yet. Aww. Sis, forgive me. I'm leaving this island. We caused so much trouble for everybody. There's no way I can stay here now. Wait. Give this to Razzly. What, 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 what are we giving to Razzly? What is it? This is from Rosetta to you. Take it with you. Uh, Razzly received the Wisp Cape, which is a piece of armor, actually. And if you look at it, it'll say it's for children's size only. Uh, it just means for, for itty-bitty little creatures. And Razzly counts. Because we'll get a couple more itty-bitty little creatures that are not necessarily children. Because I guess Razzly's not really a child. We don't really know how old she is. This island is your home now and forever. When you have settled your feelings, come back to us. Your big sis will always be waiting for you on this island. Aww. Sis. Aww. Dear sirs, please look after my sister. Although it is a hard farewell now, time shall heal the pain of our wounded hearts. And if you don't have Razzly in the party, you get a special scene with Kid. I guess her... Like, Razzly being in the party kind of just takes over all that. But yeah, if you go to the teleporter now, uh, we got Razzly back. So yeah, she's she's back with us. Okay, awesome. The problem is, if, if, if that happens, you've screwed yourself out of 
getting the Razzly's final tech. I can never get Razzly's final tech now because of this. However, what would happen if I came back to uh, Water Dragon Island? Let, okay, let me let me let me try to re-ask that question. What would happen if I killed the Hydra without Razzly in my party, thus not finding the babies, and then came back to Water Dragon Isle with Razzly in the party and faced the dwarves then? Well, I'm glad you asked. All right, so now, sudden cut to post-commentary. You're seeing footage of me having destroyed the Hi-Ho tank. This time, when I defeated the Hydra, hum the Hydra in uh, Hydra Marshes, I did not have Razzly in the party. So we never found the baby Hydras, okay? So having said that, so this dwarf, he's, he's going on and on again, you know, he's... He can't believe that we're gonna that they're gonna get driven off of their homeland. Why would the goddess of fate deal them such a hand? Yada yada yada. Are humans really the greatest species on this planet? Did he say that? I don't think he did. These heretics of evolution, these destroyers of the planet. <sighs> so like the main run of the game, uh, where I did not save kid, the dwarves just die, okay? Or they disappear. But if you go over to Rosetta... <coughs> Sis! Rosetta! Yeah, that's Rosetta. That's right. Very observant, Razzly. Razzly, is she a big sister? Very observant kid, yes. No, no, this can't be! Rosetta, answer me, please! Wait, what? If only we had gotten here a little earlier! Wait, is she dead? I'm very sorry, Sergi. Let me stay with Rosetta for a little while. Oh, snap. She's dead. Whoops. Yeah, if you don't have, uh... Hey, look look at Guile. There's Guile. See that? Yeah, this, uh... This, uh... uh I'll explain where this... Actually, I think I'll explain it now because I think I'm going to show getting the, uh... Am I going to show getting the drag... Am I going to show getting the dragons or not? I think I am. Yeah, there's no answer. It's already passed away. Yeah. Yeah, and this run, uh, I chose Guile to go to Viper Manor with me. Basically, to ex let me see if I can explain what happened. We went to... Uh, just... 480 made a big, huge mistake. And, okay, you know how when 480 messes up, uh, a lot of times I'll get my buddy 480 from the future to kind of take care of things? Well, oh, the sudden jump cut. Well, this footage you're seeing was actually recorded by 480 from the past. And it was a mistake I made involving uh, an enemy called the Cryo Sphinx. If you've already played the main run or, you know, watched the main run or played the game, you know what I'm talking about, right? All right, let's continue. Yeah, they were chased out of the forest by the humans. And they drifted to our island so the humans are to blame. Um, we humans... It's our fault everything bad ever happens in this world. Yep. And as you can see, Grasley's body is sort of lying under that tree. That uh, withered up tree. Yeah. Like I said, if you don't have Grasley in the party, you know, but you have Kid, you get a special scene with Kid. Also, if you didn't have Grasley in the party, Rosetta would not die. So, um... Basically, Rosetta dying is what you're shooting for. Rosetta dying lets you get Razzly's level 7 tech way later in the game. Sis, everybody, I'm sorry all this happened because of us. Razzly, are you really going? Yes, please take care of Rosetta. Please bury her on Moon Isle so that she may forever watch over us from above. I am leaving this island for a while, but I will return someday. Until then, goodbye. Okay, there you go. Rosetta dying. That's how you need to get Razzly's level 7 tech. Okay. So, sudden jump cut back to another world. Uh, improper save stating going on. Uh, let's try to explain ourselves a little bit. So, I, I this video had this thing called the Cryo Sphinx, 
and I screwed up in my recording. If you've watched the main run, you already know what the screw up was, because I explained it. And the only way I could re-record it, because I had nothing to fall back on, was to reload from the point where... Let's see, the point where I... Before I entered Viper Manor in, um, what you call... Termina? So I basically had to play through the entire game, pretty much, almost from the beginning. So I... Let's see, instead, I, I took Guile's path to Viper Manor, and I meant to take Nikki's path, but whatever. And I ended up deciding to take, uh, the save kid path, and I fought the Hydra without Razzly, so, um, you know, so there were no babies, so I was able to show, I, the, my point was, my plan was to, uh, record, when I got to Water Dragon Isle, I recorded it to show Rosetta dying, and then, um, I continued to play through that file, Till, till the point where Razzly's final tech became available, and I have uh, saved the game right before that point on another file. And when the time is appropriate in New Game Plus, I will show Razzly's final tech. But yeah, you have to a recruit Razzly, fight the Hydra Humor without Razzly, and go to Water Dragon Isle and fight those dwarves with Razzly. If you do all three things, Rosetta dies. And that will allow you to get Razzly's final tech. Kind of sucks that Rosetta has to die, but there you go. It's okay, she's still alive in home or, or in another world. Which, if you take Rosetta, uh, Razzly to Water Dragon Isle in home, another world, she does not react. She does not react to the fairies. She doesn't react to uh, the place being dried up. She doesn't react to Rosetta. She just doesn't react. Alright. Anyway. This is the end of this run. From here on out, the save kid path slash don't save kid path kind of coincide and everything turns out the same from this point on. So you can either A, go back and watch um, my main run where, it, where this point picks up, which would be me entering Mount Pyre. And you'll probably, if you've not seen the main run, you might be a little confused as to all the characters I've gotten. So I would advise, if you haven't already done so, just watch the whole thing. Watch. At least watch, um, start from the episode, uh, what was it called? I forget what it was called. At least watch a after we leave Viper Manor. You know, when, when we come to the split point, do you want to save or do not save Kid? Because, I mean, if you don't feel like watching Viper Manor, I mean... In my main run, I have Guile. In this run, I have Nikki. That's the only difference. But it, all the other stuff, I would advise watching starting right after we leave Viper Manor and we uh, get the option to or to not save Kid. Rewatch all that, so you're not too much in the dark. But as for this, this is the end of this. Now this playlist will continue with New Game Plus stuff. And that's what our next video will be. It will be, uh, it will be me beginning to show the different alternate endings that you can get from New Game Plus, and just a little extra bonus content. I'll try to show some of the other characters getting their final text that I was not able to show in the main run, Razzly being one of them. And yeah, so get excited for that. 480 volts. See you later.